with the news of the Queen's passing. I just wanted to ask what her legacy meant to you. I, I, I wouldn't know how to, where to begin with that. Um, I don't know. It's not often that Olivia Coleman is at a loss for words, but on Sunday, she couldn't quite come up with the words that seemed worthy to encapsulate Queen Elizabeth's impact. I am protecting the Constitution. I am protecting democracy. Olivia Coleman, The Crown. Olivia, of course, won an Emmy and a Golden Globe for playing the monarch in season three and season four of The Crown, which covered from about 1964 to 1990. It's not always a curse. There are days, in fact, more and more the older I get, when I consider it to be a blessing. She made a promise as a young woman and she absolutely kept it with such dignity, dignity and I think we're all incredibly impressed by what she did. You received an entirely appropriate education for a woman of your background, which has entirely failed to prepare me for the life I lead now. Before Olivia, Claire Foy racked up the awards for playing the Queen in season one and season two of the Netflix series. At the premiere of her new film, Women Talking, on Wednesday, Claire told the BBC, I think that she was an incredible monarch. She united people and she was a massive symbol of continuity and dignity and grace. Well, we must have her again soon. My main feeling is just thinking about her as a mother and a grandmother and a great grandmother, really. And I'm very honored to have been a teeny tiny small part of her story. I have a voice. Let me let you into a secret. No one wants to hear it. And as the crown story continues with King Charles, Olivia praised his speech after he ascended the throne. Whatever may be your background or beliefs, I shall endeavor to serve you with loyalty, respect, and love. He did it so beautifully. It was about love, um, tolerance, gentleness, and I think that's what she always wanted, and she's done. I felt very proud to be British when um, I think he's, he's going to do a good job, I think. And if one day you expect to be king... I do. ...then might I suggest you start to behave like one. It's interesting to get the perspective of actresses who played the Queen. Of course, Helen Mirren shared her thoughts last weekend. Sure, ultimately they're outsiders, just like the rest of us. But I think in having to take on the Queen's persona, they gained a little bit of insight on what her life would have been like. So it's powerful that Olivia doesn't even know what to say when it comes to yeah, trying to you know sum up what the impact of the Queen was. Really interesting. Yeah, what are your thoughts?